Hello, everyone, and welcome to Empires of the Undergrowth Free Play. Woo! So, um, I wanted to know how easy a free play game would be if we were only using the dead fish. Now, I keep on saying that, like, if we're ranking all the landmarks, the dead fish is by far the best one in the game, right? So, I wanted to see how good it actually was. If we only put it on dead fish, only dead fish will spawn. So let's find out how good they are. We're going to play as uh, vigorous fire ants. Got some leaf cutters, got the counterpart colony, the big headed ants. Let's go. I bumped them up a little bit just to see how it was going to go down. And you know what? Let's do the periodic flood, randomized caverns. And you know what? Since I like pain and suffering, let's just crank the cavern up to max. Maximum firepower. And yeah, hopefully it goes fine. Hopefully we don't die in about five seconds. I'd prefer that. It must grow quickly if it is to survive. It must grow quickly in order to survive. And we will grow quickly. Seriously, once we get outside, I think we're going to be fine. I think we'll have all the food in the world. Because as you know with fire ants, or may know with fire ants, once you get them going, whew. Fire ants and fish only, yes. I just kind of wanted to see how accurate my claims are. I was going to say, you better not open something up, otherwise I'm going to be upset. New, no, just open that. There we go. I like to do them in tiles, so that way I can upgrade everything. That's so easy, I know. That's why I bumped up the enemy AI a little bit, just to like you know, make it a little bit more fair. And I also got the tankiest enemies around, so hopefully that'll maybe make up for my fire ants. We'll see. We shall see. Or are they on? Uh, they're on Cheater. So nothing too crazy, but, you know, because, like, if I just put them any higher, they'll, they're going to have free... You know, a free army. It doesn't matter how many ants I throw at them. It's just like, it's never going to end. Tanks being leaf cutters and big heads. Yeah. And I also did the counterpart colony. So they have, you know, oh, I probably should uh, open up a chamber and start opening. Corrupt is impossible. Yeah, it really is. Like, if you want to win on corrupt, set you the environmental difficulty to insane. And then just wait for the enemy AIs to dig into their nest and kill them. That's the only way you're winning. Open up this chamber. And... Ooh, spider wings. Well, they're going to die. Perfection. Uh, I just got so sick of, you know, always leaving my videos being like... Well, I can't push, so I guess I'm just going to end the stream here so I can go to bed tonight. Army ants kind of demolish fire ants. I don't know about that one. I do not know. Yes, fish only. We shall have fish. And I, did, I put us on towhead so that way, you know, it wouldn't look completely ridiculous with the map being completely flooded with only fish. And we are actually, for once, going to go to the surface right away. I know! Crazy concept! I can't break through, so I'm just going to go to sleep. Well, I mean, yeah, that's literally what I do. When I end my streams, I'm just like, listen, I can break this, maybe. It's just, you know, a matter of time, so I don't want to deal with it, so I'm going to bed. Oh my god, what happened here? It's a slaughter... So, yeah, we got fish right outside of our nest. Well, a few fish, actually. Ah, uh, there is a ramp. I just can't see it. I'm blind in my eyes. And that's too short. That's long enough. Yep. Just planning this out, actually. 
We may want to open that up soonish. I think when we get 10 fire ants, I'll open this up. Embankment with fish only. Mm. Nah. Again, if I beat this hands down, why would I ever do this again? I'm, you know, I might put it on higher difficulty. But, you know, I wouldn't do it again just like this. I would either, like, choose a harder colony, like, say, maybe black ants. And then, I don't know, try it on a harder colony difficulty. That's probably what I'd do. Probably. Oh, I'm sorry, Rolly Poly. You have done goofed. Like, you just see how effective fire ants are. Because, like, Rolly Polies just take forever to kill, but the, the one fire ant's just like, yeah, your subscription to life has ended. Fucking die, please. Little black ant or normal black ant? Normal black ant. Because, in my opinion, they are the weakest colony. Just fall back. So we got the all the poor murdered pill bugs. Oh, it was a slaughter. Not and not just the men too, but the women and the children. Is Uber has more food than fish? Yeah, they have three thousand food. Every Uber gives you three thousand food. Every fish gives you two thousand. Uh, one point five. See, 1.5. That's brand new fish. Anyway, we're going to open this up real quick. And also clear out that tile so it's a straighter shot. Now, we shouldn't die. Shouldn't. Doesn't mean we won't. As I've learned... Oh, okay. Devil's Coach Horse. Oh, I just realized we are vigorous, so that does help things out a bit. Oh, but that spray. Doesn't matter. We will get you eventually. Our stings are merciless. Yeah. Oh, well, we are out of food. That is unfortunate, but it's fine because it's dead. Haul the food back, please. I want our... Colony backed up to tip top shape. Hip hip cheerio, beans on toast, and all that jazz. Hmm. Do I open that up next? I think I do. I think I do open it up. So let's get the food stores built. Mostly, anyway. And let's open it on up. And let's pray we don't run into something. Okay. Uh, that's a little bit worse. But it's an open area, so maybe? Oh, God, no. I just realized we didn't replace all the eggs. That's a small problem. Here, just ignore those. Go back to egg collection or egg placing duties, please. Mm, I may have made a oopsie. I made a small oopsie whoopsie. But luckily, I just had the ants ignore them, so they should hatch any minute now and surround. Yeah, I made a small mistake, but you know, it's fine. You can come back. There's so much food lying around. Does it really matter if I made a mistake or two? Apparently it might. Um, collect food, please. Shit. <laughs> I may have done goofed. Shit. <laughs> I think we need a list of all the bugs that are worth for food. Well, really, it's two things. A, it's whatever was created before Formicarium 4. And second off, it's what you consider worth it. Yeah, um, that didn't happen. It wouldn't be a stream of mine if I didn't fuck up in one way or another. <laughs> Just saying. It's fine. You didn't see anything. But I did 
Eyes on the flippers. If you don't like penguins in Madagascar, I'm sorry, but I don't like you. I think we'll leave it there. Hmm. Trying to figure out my approach. All right, so we can open that up and that'll be free food. Free, free. Actually, let's just open it up. Oh, glorious. Glorious spoils. And oh, more food. Thank you for all the delicious food. Keep adding. Now let's take a look at around our nest and see what might be a good idea to attack first and which ones might be a good idea to never touch. For a while, anyway. I think, honestly, we should just, you know, consider this like a normal playthrough and just stay underground for a bit. I'm not talking like as long as I normally do, just because these are fire ants, but maybe just a little bit longer. Wait, too late. It's dead. It may be kind of dead already. Then we'll add another one too. Hmm. Normally we have a much smaller threat to deal with, but I'm not seeing any small threats. Hmm. Lovely. The only ones who take actual food and not leaves, right? Yeah. Yeah, so, um... Oh, today's your birthday? Oh, happy birthday! Hope you enjoy it. How old are you turning? Uh, I'm hoping this is not going to kill us. Ah, fuck. Um... Nah, that's a restart. They're too tanky. We need more Empires of the Undergrowth War. Yeah, that's a restart. They're just too tanky. Oh, what fresh hell have I found myself in? You know what? They don't care. We're just going for it. I should just fill my entire underground with nothing but... Oh, I should have gone... Ooh! Ooh. All right. Tell me if you think this would be a good idea, all right? We go pervasive fire ants and fill in our entire underground with nothing but soldiers. Like, literally every tile underground is just going to be a fire ant soldier, all right? What do you think? Good idea, bad idea, horrible idea, or terrifying idea? What would I do? Oh, actually, I could do like an erector. Yes! Oh my god, yes! What I could do is I could go erector, right? Because like, that that's the exact same thing. I could go... Oh, actually, I think I'd have to make an erector colony because I think I chose vigorous. Yeah, pretty sure I did. We could go an erector colony, right? That's just pervasive fire ants, right? Go Royal Decree and just fill in our entire underground. <laughs> and we'll we'll give um I don't know, maybe some maybe a good buff or something, I don't know. <laughs> insane def listen, the environment will be insane, all the colonies will be corrupt. It'll be a great time, trust me. <laughs> My eyes will hurt. My eyes! That'll be you, just screaming my eyes. But... I know, it sounds like a genius idea. But the work sees... Uh, no work sees. Just soldiers. We're all soldiers now. I just think it's such a stupid idea that would be honestly kind of hilarious to see. 
And like, I think pervasive is the only way that'll make it work. And by the way, I'm going to keep on um, the maintenance. So like every single fire ant will cost me more and more. What's going on, Lucian? How are you? Hmm. Well, I seem to have... You know what? I'm just going to pretend that I don't see that. Take out another chamber. That'll show him. Another two. Um, we'll dig into this. I think we can take that. Oh, Devil's Coach Horse Lava? Fine. Easy. Easy dub. He definitely saw the rocks, guys. Yeah, yeah, I saw all the hate comments, too. You know, just being like, listen, I wish you would roll into a grave and die for coming up with such a horrific idea. Um, let's go there. Spider wings, yes! Perfect. Exactly what I want to see. Easy. Like, what would they balance? How would they balance the spiderlings? Like, how low would you make the food gain from that? Like, would you just do like two food from it? Oh, that would be not at all worth it in the slightest. <laughs> Listen, the larva is a different story than the adult, all right? And you know it. An adult? Yes. That'll probably murder me at such a small army. Adult or baby? Listen, I like killing babies. So nobody quote that, please. Um, all right, we'll just go down here. Let's pray that we don't open something we weren't supposed to. The colony is starving. There is not enough food to feed. Spiderlings. Okay, I can handle that. Maybe. I'm hoping I can. Because if not, we're kind of in trouble. Signs are pointing to yeah, maybe? No, no, no. Can I stop screwing everything up? Listen, there's kind of a blocked path to the outside. That one was actually blocked. Um, Many challenges Fine. I'll do it the plebeian way, jeez. I'll do it like all you fucking normies. You disappoint me. Will that open? I don't think it will, but I might want to prepare to restart. So I might die. Eh, story of my life. Tap to things that smell like fish. Wow. Wow, I can't believe you did that and then you deleted it. How rude and inconsiderate. Get over there, please, and grab the food. Don't have any patience for you. 26, yeah, there's not much free food. Although, I have a feeling, if we're lucky, we can take that out with workers. Because we do have our stinger. So, there's that. Why was it deleted? I didn't even read it. I don't know. It was one of those things that confused me when I read it, and then it was deleted, and I'm like, oh, oh I, all right, bye. <laughs> Finally, a soldier has risen from the ashes of... Just a couple failed colonies, nothing too major. Defeated by workers, I know. Alright, that's my second genius idea. Nothing but workers. Filling the entire underground with nothing but workers. <laughs> Empires of the undergrowth, but my ideas get worse and worse. 
It's getting worse. Uh, good. That's what I was aiming for. Good to know I'm giving you the satisfaction that you're looking for. I have an idea. All right. Is it probably going to end in the fireball of death? Because if so, I want to listen. Hmm. Let's see. A few more workers. The underground but filled with the worst ant possible. That's hey, that's no no fair, okay? That's not cool to saying that kind of things about your mom, alright? You know, she she's a nice lady, and you know you know you don't have to disrespect her like that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Listen, I know this might surprise you, but I'm kind of a bit of an asshole. Anyway, there's more food. Yay! Mm, that doesn't seem like a good idea. I'm an expert on not good ideas. Knew that was coming. <laughs> yeah, this is the first to have not good a lot. That reminds me of like some of the one of the best uh, memes I saw with that one. It was like, Dad, can you explain to me dark humor? All right, uh, you see that kid over there, you know, with uh, no hand, no arms. Go tell him to clap. But Dad, I can't see exactly. It's like that. Oh my god, that's so fucked, but so funny at the same time. All right, there's our fish. You happy now, chat? You happy? We're going for the fish. Dark humor at its finest. All right, please harvest that fish before... There we go, there's the ants. All right, you're carving more off. I appreciate your dedication, soldiers. Um, hmm. Now the question is, yeah, we'll just go down here. Fine, I'll make a separate group of soldiers. I won't be an idiot and try and carve out a perfect nest off the get-go, even if I want to. Pooh. The ants will battle to the death. Now, oh, by the way, I do have periodic flood on, just so you know. What do we think would be the best threat to take out first? Up here in the top of the screen is the big-headed ants. I think they are probably the enemy we want to go after the least. To our north is the counterpart colony. And to the south is... Um, the leaf cutters. What do you think would be a good idea? Do we go after the leaf cutters or the counterpart? Here, I'm going to give everyone a pull. No, hey, keep your clothes back on. Not that kind of pull. Jeez, ugh, disgusting. Uh, what colony to take out? First. Counter part. Leaf cutters. If I can spell. And you know, just because big headed. Yeah, where's my mouse? There's my mouse. Alright, there you go. Go wild. So weird seeing leaves on the beach. Yeah, just a little. But it's fine. When has a little bit of leaf killed anyone? Uh, don't don't ask anyone that's died to hemlock, okay? I, I, I'm pretty sure that's not leaf, but, you know, whatever. So much fish. Oh, it's so good seeing so much fish. That's why I chose this map specifically. Just because I was like, you know what? 
This seems plausible for a bunch of fish to spawn, so why not? We should also probably think about where a food store would go. Well, gotta go. Oh, yeah, good luck. Have fun. Hope you enjoy playing Empires of the Undergrowth. Big headed ants. Everyone's saying the big headed ants. You're doing that just to troll with me, aren't you? Like, you're just being like, he says this is probably the worst one to go for, so go for it. No, go ahead and suffer. Suffer for my entertainment. And, you know, I respect that. I disagree with it, but respect it. I don't know. I think I'm going to harvest what's left of this fish. Or, like, fill up this chamber with with uh, workers. Or not, sorry, workers. Soldiers. And then try to open up some of the chambers underground once our food stores are full. Just because we need a little bit more space than we need food. Counterpart might steamroll you, and leaf cutters are absolutely going to steamroll you. Yeah, at this size, I'm not going to attack them now. I'm not that stupid, jeez. I'm just slightly stupid. You reminded me of... Oh. Well then, fuck you. And we're actually going to go up here and expand this soldier nest. Probably should have waited till our soldiers were all back, but... It's fine. Oh, it's just a bunch of spiderlings, anyway. Nothing to worry about. Water rises. Alright. Not a problem. Oh, let's not open those. I don't know what they are. And to be honest, I don't really want to find out. But I'll find out what that is. Just a bunch of Devil's Coach Horse larva. That's fine. I love killing babies. You're going to go play an arc? All right, well, and you enjoy that. Yeah, I want to put it close to the entrance. Unfortunately, everything close to the entrance is very murderous looking. Just saying. All right, yeah, I can deal with that. Whatever's in there. But I still want to get my army size a bit higher than that. Just to deal with it, because... Well, I don't want to restart again. I just don't. If I die again, I think I'll just restart the stream. You know, just be like, well, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed. Yo, fuck you. Alright, there we go. Oh, it's a crab. God damn it. Crabs put me in a crabby mood. Hey! I'll shut up now. But we did kill it, so there is that. That's 110 food right in our pocket. Lovely. <laughs> Terrible. Listen, if you wanted quality content, you came to the wrong place. The absolute worst place. <laughs> like, if, if you wanted some good jokes, go. I don't know. I, I, see, I'm that bad, I can't even come up with a joke. It's fine, we're expanding our nest just fine. Oh, excuse me. What is it, this? So it's treason, then. The big headers are attacking us. Which I honestly did not see coming. Alright, everyone group up to the entrance. We told- No one said anything about them attacking. He said to go for them, but he didn't say anything about them attacking. Oh. Looks like the counterpart- Are they going for me too? No. I want to keep an eye out on what's going on outside, because it looks like absolutely terrifying. Oh god, the leaf cutters are attacking me now. I think this might be Rip. 
long have I been streaming? Wow. Oh, a grand half hour. Fantastic. Guess what we're doing? Re re restarting. I know. And this is why I stay underground until I have a gigantic army, all right? This is apparently the last save. Think we can do something with this? Nah, probably not. So I'm just going to quit the main menu and restart this. Yeah. I know. I know. I'm such an embarrassment. You know, failure. Never been done. So original. You know what? Yeah, I'll just keep it on vigorous. We'll keep them on cheater. And only dead fish. But I will add all the enemy creatures because I don't think I did that last time. I definitely did not do the ubers. Ugh. And where's my caverns? Seriously, where's my caverns? Boop. Not little, normal. There's no little. What are you talking about? There's nothing little. Except for my queen. Alright. Now we're in the big leagues. Listen, we're not respart, respart, restarting again, okay? If we fail, we fail, alright? But this time, I will not accept failure. So if we fail, I'm having someone shot. Alright, that's just the cold, harsh reality of it. You lose, pray to God. Nah. Nah, that's a no for me, dog. Later. Later, spiky boy. Wait a minute, I just realized I didn't put it to Toehead. Shit. Oh well. There'll be a bunch of fish, but no water. It's fine. It's be fine. I honestly don't like Toehead, to be honest. I think it's too tight of a map. Oh, uh, never mind. All right, got a decent amount of soldiers now. We got about five. Now, where would be a good place to open? Literally none of these, in my opinion. But this seems like the best bet, so I'm going to do it. Mm, you better not be a, a bad surprise. You're a bad surprise. God damn it. <laughs> ah! I like how I to t you know, touted how easy this was going to be. And I never restarted more for a stream in my life. <sighs> Ironic, isn't it? Here's a terrible idea. There's only room for one person given terrible ideas, all right? And that's me. Come on, start gathering food, please. I don't have time for your shit. There we go. Okay. Looks like we got a better early game, though, than the last time. Last time, it was just like, here's, like, no food at the start. You're welcome. Human suffering, peak entertainment, I know. That's why I do it. You you better enjoy you speaking of which, if you like my suffering, give this video a like and subscribe to see more suffering. There'll be more eventually. No, I set the I set the colonies. Terrible but amazing entertainment idea. Okay, go ahead. 
I can't. I can't do what? I can't touch your butt? But it's so touchable. Open that up. Alright, good. Yeah, it's just a rogue beetle. The battle has begun. Easy peasy. Let's also open up. Mm. That's looking real iffy. Alright, crisis averted. No, oh, I can, I can give ideas. <laughs> Convincing enough. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Open that up, please. Alright, that's a good amount of food. That's a good amount. Should at least give us... 12, yeah, we'll have enough for 12 fire ants. And then enough food to hatch them all. After that, who knows? So that's 12, okay. Okay. Now where do we go? That's a good question. Oh! Well, the choice is obvious. Whoever this thing is. Whoops, spiraling, that's fine. We can take that out, no problem. He's, I've restarted like four times. You know he's been here since the beginning. Uh, I'm going to open this. No. Mm, fine, I'll open it this way. I'll open it the boring way. I can see the future t-shirt merchandise. Oh yeah, what's that? Give me ideas. <laughs> Give me ideas because I'm a, you know, mass conglomerate that needs ideas to rip off of its people. Alright. Should probably find a different chamber to start with. Uh, let's just, yeah, let's use this one since it's already half done. Perfection. Perfection. Um. Oh yeah, so, by the way, I did look at the results of the poll I posted on my channel. And it seems that at least half of you want, would rather see me do hibernation on Insane over all the other extra levels I put on there, so... I am thinking of strategies for it, but it's going to take me a while. I did not really like that level in the first place and was honestly very terrible at it. But, and here's the but, I do think I will be able to do it and as a bonus, do it as a workers only challenge. So yeah, I'm sure you'll all enjoy it. Open up. Let me in! Oh, rogue beetles. Should be fine. Should. Seems to be going fine. For now. All the food after, though. Oh. Oh. So much food. All the food. Oh, yeah. That's what I want to see. That's what I want to see from every pocket, just an infinite amount. Workers only is peak suffering. Don't you know it? All right, we'll wait for all those uh, creatures to hatch. And then I think I'll go down here and open up whatever this is. It shouldn't be too, too bad. Play the aisle. Um, I think I actually have that. Hang on. Hang on, I'm checking my games. What, what game do I have? I had something similar to it. Yeah, I have the aisle. I do. But insects don't feel pain. No, but whoever's controlling the insects does. Let's go say, 
It doesn't matter. Insects do feel pain. They have pain receptors, probably. That's actually a really big issue. I was not expecting false bombardier beetles. This might have been a little too much for us to chew. But we are thinning their numbers. Mm, I think it's going to be close. But I think we will win. Yes. Oof. I was a little closer than I would have liked. But look at all that hatching, though. Satisfying. Stonks. Here, I'm just going to dig away to the entrance, so that way we can start opening that up soon and start planning everything. Stop starving the ants, jeez. Well, I'm sorry that the underground is terrifying and deadly. And we'll open that up. Yep, food storage definitely needed. I'm going to finish this ant chamber, though. There we go. Stig my on Stig. <laughs> no, what what is the best ant species? That's a very good question. Um, hmm. It depends on who you talk to. Um, wood ants are definitely pretty strong. Like if you're talking about colony, like. Let's, let's say for argument's sake, we, we just ignore Eruptors, all right? And that pulls old. Let me end that real quick. So let's just say we're eliminate, we're talking about colonies and we're talking not about Eruptors. Like, let's just say Eruptors don't exist. Chuck them out the window. Ye Yeetus the fetus. Um, so that means we're left with black ants, wood ants, leaf cutters, fire ants, big headed and little black ants. Yeah, let's just t assume we're talking about that. Black ants, no. Uh, leaf cutters, no, they're too expensive. They're, they're they're good and powerful, but they're too expensive. They suck in the early game. They really do. Wood ants, they're pretty good. They're pretty good. They're probably one of the stronger ones. Um, big headed ants, great unit, but terrible other units and we'll go down here yeah they're good numbers but they're just as cheap as workers which is what makes them so strong is that they're just as cheap as workers but so much more effective wood ants have a way to win the game while fire ants don't really i mean fire ants are really good in the early game and the late game because again you get two ants per you know ant you know, per tile when they're at level three, which is just incredible. Truly a fantastic move. I'm not going to open this up, actually. And upgrade you to level three just because I want more ants. Oh, row beetles. Oh, adult row beetle. That's not what I want to see. That's less than I want to see. Stop getting confused. Like, these row beetles are honestly, in my opinion, some of the elite, the most annoying creatures in the game just because of how quick they get their spray. And we're starting to lose some. We're starting to lose a bit of ground. Please kill one. Okay. Now we might actually stand a chance. Uh, never mind. Um, unupgrade. Don't, don't upgrade. Devolve. You know what? We're just going to devolve all that just so we have enough food to actually survive. All right, two of them are down. Besides, there's so many fish above ground that, you know, we don't need to. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Perfection. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. There we go. And that is how we saved it. And also why I hate rogue beetles. <laughs> I'm gonna let my ants get the, some food back real quick. And then I'm just gonna open that up because I don't think it'll be too bad. 
famous last words. <laughs> what are you? Oh, okay, that's easy. I don't even need to pay attention to it. Yep, there we go. Taken care of. And now let's start getting some level threes going. Boop, boop, boop. That way we can upgrade the entire chamber to level three at some point. And we'll do a few level threes in the innermost. It's not GG. See, I told you you were overreacting. Mm. It's fine. You you were panicking for nothing. See, I'm so amazing at this game that I can recover from sure death. See? That's what I do. I'm just oh fuck. Me my big mouth, eh? <laughs> they're not as bad as the other row beetles, but they're still not good. Because their spray is a lot slower. It's just as deadly. Actually, probably more deadly, but... Pervasive supremacy. I mean, I do really think pervasive is the way you should go for um, free play, but... You know. Not much I can do about it. So I wanted to do... Uh, vigorous and also show off how how strong all the food is from the fish but here I am not showing off anything about the fish <laughs> just because I'm so bad I'm like that dog meme send help I need I, I don't have enough ants I don't have enough food because like the the you know the buff doggo is just like I can take on corrupt three corrupt AIs and the insane environment. And then there's me being like, please help, I open up a devil's coach horse. All right, upgrade all you to level three. Whew. That's going to be a spicy army. Oh, checker beetles, Pff, easy. Yeah, I don't, I'm not worried about the checkered beetles because they don't have any weird sprays. They have good, you know, speed and good attack, but they also don't have spray, so that's it's really nice. Really nice to see. I'm tempted to open that. I'm opening it. <laughs> um, yeah, let's do some upgrades. There we go. Oh, that's what I love to see. Oh, that's not what I love to see. Hmm. Did I mess up again? I swear, everything out of my mouth has just been, I have done goofed. I have messed up in a horrific way, and I will never recover. What would a blobfish look like with a flesh? Only 20 food per beetle. Yeah, I know. It's pretty embarrassing. Like, the food isn't the issue. It's more... You know, the damage they do. Alright, we're thinning out the beetle hordes. I think we're fine. Yeah, we're fine, but it was it was terrifying at the bit beginning. There's not enough food to feed it's fine. You're overreacting. See, I'm so amazing at this game. I telepathically told the beetles to just die, to just roll over and die, and they did it. You're welcome. Uh, now we're now let's open up this. <laughs> uh, I'm not that stupid. I'm getting there, but not there yet. <laughs> um, yeah, let's add some more fire ants to our colony. Yeah, let's finish off this nest chamber. And then we'll see how much food we have stored up there. You're going to be super strong when you finally get to the surface, right? That's the plan. I mean, we're already in a decent spot. 
upgrade our food stores just so that way I make smarter decisions. Uh, somewhat smarter decisions. Open that up. Wrong. When you're so wrong, you spell wrong wrong. If I don't die, maybe. Oh, hermit crabs. I'm not worried about their strength. I'm just worried about their tanking ability. But that doesn't seem to be an issue right now. Yeah, I think we'll be able to win this one. Yeah, we got plenty of food. And then we're going to get 700-ish food. Big-headed ants going to be at your doorstep. I know, probably. That's fine. That'll be fun. Uh, what did I miss? Oh, these two. All good. See, we're all good. Yeah, they're all just waiting for me to come out. Not fighting each other, obviously. Get some speed tiles to surround the nest chamber so I can actually upgrade it. And you know what? Maybe I should get some uh, workers. Imagine that. What a noble con or a novel concept. Yeah, let's get some workers. Some run low and stuff. I think that would honestly... I don't know what they should do to, like... If they do add multiplayer, they have to definitely deal with the entrance being dug out. I don't know if they would just do, like, after 10 minutes, the or, like, something like that, the entrance would just open automatically, like, in a lot of levels, or if they would just be like, hey, listen, so you can dig out the enemy colonies... I don't know which would be better. Get a bunch of workers, so that way we can actually sustain our army. And just do a few upgrades, just a few, nothing major. Hmm, maybe I've gone overboard. Ah, well, let's open that up. I'm sure it'll be fine. All right, workers are a little busy at the moment, but it's fine. They'll get to it when they get to it. Hey, buddy, listen, you can dig out other colonies. Go crazy, it'll be fun. The ants must fight. Yeah, I, I would. I hope there's a multiplayer, but you never know. I, I, I think if Empires of the Undergrowth had like a multiplayer game mode, I think it would be really good thing for the game. Not only would it drive sales as, you know, you can play it with a friend or, you know, go online. I just think it would be something that they could keep updating and just add it like free play updates, you know, adding a new colony or something like that. And I think it would be a really good addition for both the players and also the devs. Do, da, na, na. Here, I'm going to do something a little bold. I'm going to dig out the entrance. All right. And I'm going to have one group stay underground and another group go out and collect fish. All right. Multitasking. I know, scandalous. How dare I I'll, uh, do something smart. We'll have group one out there, and I'll have group two. They got this. <laughs> so I don't know what's in there, and I want to find out. And upgrade our food store so that way we can handle all the food that we're getting. Oh, just hermit crabs. Nothing major. Like, hermit crabs are very deadly to small colonies, but like... At a certain point, they're just a nuisance. They're not... Like, they, they're not deadly even in large groups. They're just a pain. PvP would be best for the battle arena? I mean, maybe. Or, like... 
you know, I think would be honestly the best PvP experience in Empires of the Undergrowth, doing like tug of war, but multiplayer style. I think that might be the best way. Maybe. Or well, maybe not. I don't know. Oh yeah, I've I've seen the uh, other defeat screen. Yeah, not because I've lost, because well, I would just restart if you know if I got to that point. But you know, I've seen someone recorded it, and it looks interesting. It's like oh, a nice little attention to detail. Now where do I go? Let's take out this, whatever it is. And also probably should plan out another colony or another nest chamber. Yeah, there we go. Let's do one of those. Don't need to take that out, so. What do we have over here? Oh, Devil's Coach Horse. Easy. Easy claps. Greater food stores to max. And let's get these fire ants rolling. I think I'll put you in group two. Just to make sure we don't, you know, fuck up anymore. All right, you go up there and you dig that. Oh, there's some extra food there. We'll get it eventually. It's fine. We don't need it all right now. Now, green is being a little bit quiet. Blue is lead cutter, and this is the counterpart. All right, so this would be the big headed. Good to know. Oh, fuck. Probably my least favorite thing to come across. Just the infinite chain stuns. Yeah, they're not cool. Who is attacking you? Nah, it does not look like it. Looks like they're getting a little distracted by something, just saying. So, though it can be hard to tell whether they're attacking or just feeding. You know, whether it's just uh, an attack line or a foraging line. Oh my god, just kill its leg, please. Stop getting stunned. There we go. Kill one of them. There we go. Now we have a chance of actually killing them before we lose all of our food. Actually, now we're gaining food. And that's why I split them up. I know, I, I, listen, I don't think the Harvestmen are the, are they the biggest thing? No, I think the biggest thing is the Whip Spider. Like, how do they fit in our chambers? Who knows? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Mm, there might be a small issue. Between the Harvestman and the counterpart attacking me, ugh. Small nightmare. But actually, I think we're doing better than they are, because... Yeah, def they're definitely coming in, but... Oh! We're taking care of them up there! Yes! Perfect! They're not really a threat anymore when they're in small groups, so like, we can, hand we can hold out, actually. In fact, I'm going to send a third group up there just to click the food. Just because they're not that much of a threat, and I need to keep an eye on the door. Perfect. We've secured our back line. I know. Well, and that's why, in my opinion, fire ants are better than soldiers, or than army ants, because, like, We've already gotten two colony, or two ant chambers to level three, right? Yes, they have army ant majors, but they're level one. And it'll cost them so much food to get them upgraded. It just wouldn't be worth it for them. But us, oof. 
we only have one choice, and that's to go up. <laughs> but they're cheating. I know they're cheating, but... You, you know, they still need food to add to their count, just saying. And they're, if they're cheating, shouldn't they be better than us? All right, well, here comes the leaf cutters. Or no, the big headed. Oh, that's a lot of super majors. Ooh, okay. I hope we can hold the line. Looks like yes. It just, you know what I've noticed is weird? It seems like whenever one colony decides to attack you, all three decide to do that. What does level three army ant majors do? They just have better, um, better uh, flash buff. Army ants are better against creatures. Yep. Are they still attacking me or have they gone their separate ways? Let's just put all of us in one group. We'll be back there for the rest of the food eventually. Because this chamber right there. Yeah, okay. They're not coming back for... They're coming back for round two. That's fine, we'll get plenty of food. And actually, I think we're in such a good position we can actually upgrade. We're sieged and we can even improve. What an amazing thing. I mean, I knew green was coming. I just, you know, was wanting to get some food. Especially since they're only big headed ants. It's really the super majors you gotta watch out for. Otherwise, eh, eh I don't know about that one. All right, a few more soldiers have made it underground. Unfortunately, we are going to lose a few. Uh, but they're going to lose a few of them, so I guess it all adds up in the end. Grab that food, please. There we go. Thank you. Just because might as well. All right, yeah, they're pulling back. Fish! Fish! All right. We're going to upgrade those to level three. And just strip this fish bear in about five seconds. It's up there, small fish. Uh, good sized fish. We'll harvest this bear, and then we'll go down south to that fish. And then I think we might actually want to take on the uh, big-headed ants. Get them out of our way. Well, actually, no. I think we may have, be have a better chance against the army ants. Although, it seems like the leaf cutters are going to go test them. So let's stay out of their way. And just keep upgrading. Keep calm and keep upgrading. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. All right, so what's going on over here? Oh, oh that's Mantis Fly. Nothing too major. Leaf Cutters are doing their own thing. Big Headed Ants are doing something. Well, they're trying to do something, but they're failing at it. And there we go. Three chambers of level three fire ants. Haha. <laughs> Very nice. Mwahaha. <laughs> That's only 25% of our worker population, too. Remember that. 38 times. Okay, so let's take 19 times 3 is 57. So times 4 to 28. So I'd have to roughly estimate that about 250 fire ants can be allowed. So about 500 fire ants at level 3. That's my guess. Hmm. We are getting so much food. Whew. Yeah, okay. Big-headed... Big-headed or counterpart, which one should I go for? 
once we're done with this fish. Consider that your doomsday clock. So then I'll just pick one and we'll try our luck. Upkeep is no annoying, but I don't care. I don't. It doesn't affect the AI because they have like a nest design that they're going to follow regardless of whether or not there's. Yeah, so like they're just going to make the amount of ants they're going to make. I actually don't want to attack the counterpart, so I'm going to go big headed. Because you don't see any of the uh, counterpart, do you? Which is because they're all down there crowding the entrance. And that's a small problem, but whatever. I don't care to deal with it. And we're not putting our marker on the nest, because otherwise they'll start going underground and grouping up at the entrance. I wanted a bit of my army there before they got all grouped up. <laughs> Now, can we break through before things start going bad? That's a good question. Can we kill enough of them where it doesn't matter if they get their free stuff? And it's just those super majors that we have to think about. Because everyone knows the majors are a joke. Looks like a maybe. They don't have a lot of food. In fact, we're gaining food, it looks like. Oh, we're about to break through to the food chambers. Nice. And now the Royal Queen's chambers shall be destroyed. Probably. There will be nothing that will divide our great empire. Oh, maybe except for those chain stuns. Ugh. Yeah, okay. Things are starting to get a little rough, but... We're just cleaning up the stragglers is all. Uh, looks like we might lose a bit of our progress. Looks like that is a yes. We did lose a bunch of progress. Oh, leaf cutter's coming in. Let's just back out. Let's back out. In fact, I don't know. Do I need more fire ants? I'm going to group, try to take out the counterpart. Let's see what they're going for. Little black snowball effect plus major damage buff would be insane. Yeah. Okay, let's see how the leaf cutters are doing. I think they're doing okay. Yeah, it looks like they're winning. Oh, that army going in there. Ooh, that's a big yikes. Wouldn't want to be them. Speaking of wouldn't want to be them, let's see what's going on in here. Oh, interesting. Now they do get a stacking damage buff. But army ants are very frail. So hopefully we have the damage capacity to out damage them. Because they can't hold the line like the big headed ants can. They just don't have the big, the best tanks. Like it's really just the majors that are the tanks and they're decent at it, but they're mostly for doing damage than for holding a line. There we go. Starting to get our reinforcements back in there. Yes. I think if we can keep up a constant stream, we can take them. Mm, but maybe we need more ants. I'm going to say we need more ants. So everyone, fall back. We're going to go up here. We're going to finish out our underground, okay? Because, uh, actually, there is fish. Fish! Where's my underground? We're just going to ignore that. And we're going to take out the fish. Harvest it. Uh, yeah, I think... Yeah, just one more fire ant group. So that way... 
Because, like, my line was continuous all the way there, but it was very thin. It needs to be thicker in order to take it on. It needs to be thick with about five C's, all right? And up. And give us a place for our fire ant domain to hatch. I'm almost wondering if I need more workers. <laughs> Maybe in the next chamber. Maybe. Yeah, that'll probably be a good idea. So let's start planning it, actually. And you know what? Let's just build it. Can we build it? Yes, we can. Do do dun 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 All right, about 300 foods left. Upgrade all of you to level two. So that way you're not completely wimpy. Um, I mean, finish it. Oh, listen, pal. You may have picked the wrong day. I mean, I mean, it's not the worst idea, but the problem with the fish is there's always a stream of wood ants, and workers just, I don't think, have the power to take on wood ants. Ooh, what is your favorite colony to play as? That's a very good question, all right? I, in my opinion, uh, everything has its merits, all right? I don't like playing as black ants. I think they're just, they just suck, all right? I, I don't really like playing as wood ants. I mean, I get that they're, they're very strong, but I just don't like the micromanagey of take you know dealing with mortars and stuff i would have to say probably my my favorite colony is either the little black ants or the fire ants i just like how aggressive and swarmy they are like the fire ants are definitely aggressive little black ants a little less aggressive but they they there is no denying their power well i can't i can't deny their power other people have and will. <laughs> Alright, move up. Come on. Small fish. We won't worry about that. Oh. Little black ants are dead. Or not the little black ants. Big headed ants are dead. I guess the leaf cutters got them. Can I get an F in the chat for the big headed ant colonies? There we go. Finally dug in. Oh, there's another one. How dare there be another chamber that we have to open up. It's fine. We'll break through this line and then we'll steal whatever's left. Nom. Just stealing all that food real quick. And where's my... Oh, there's the worker. Good. Oh, no, an adult. Whatever shall I do? It's almost like I didn't kill five of your kids. Deed. Bring all the food back, please. Thank you. And now we'll just go south and be a little reckless. They, they were forgettable. You thought they were little black ants. I mean, you're not wrong. You really aren't wrong. I don't know if we're going to be able to break the leaf cutters, to be honest. That might be a little rough. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, wow. That's a lot of checker beetles. Holy shit. Also, my army wasn't really there, ready to take them. But it's fine. We'll get them eventually. Leaf cutters are scary. I mean... We, you saw how rough we had it against the uh, 
big headed ants. Now the leaf cutters aren't stunned, they are taunt. But it's really their tankiness that scares me. Just that the fact that I don't think I'll be able to break through because they'll be ha able to have such high health to withstand any punishment I deal out that, you know, they'll just have to wait out until they get the free hatch and then it's GG. Oh, more crabs. Okay. It's fine by me. I guess we're just not going to pay attention to the crabs. We're just going to be like, here's some good beetle. Level three, please, and thank you. I wonder if they're going to add more spe ant species. Oh, yeah, they're definitely going to for Formicarium 5. Excuse me. After that, who knows? They themselves have said that they don't know what they're going to add to the game. There we go. That's another level three group of ants ready to murder. Then finish off this. Now, do I hold off and get another group of them? Or do I just go directly for the kill and try and get the counterparts? Well, there is two fish in the middle. I'll go for the fish. I'll get the fish. Yeah, let's get the fish. Yeah, we should be able to get rid of all the hermit crab food. And there we go, yeah. The leaf cutters don't care about it. But the counterpart will. First things first on our agenda, we have to open up an area. Just you, me, and this brick wall that you built between us. They'll add another Ansys post for carry and 5 content as well. I have no idea. Hard to say, really. Leaf cutter major should be mountable. No, I don't I don't think they should be. I wasn't asking you. My home assistant, whose name I should not mention because she'll activate. No, you're just getting unplugged. <laughs> I kept thinking, and I was like, I don't know what it's saying or if it's compiling a report to the FBI on me, but you know, I just needed to go. Get over there. Oh, a third fish! Oh! This is even better! I think adding more features and having mod support to the game is more important than the ants that they can add after the game. Yeah. Like, most of the ants shouldn't be too hard to add. Most colonies shouldn't be. Because you already have the basic groundwork. You just need the art and maybe a few small modifications to how you play them, and you're good to go. Now, I'm not sure why the leaf cutters are challenging me. Oh. Might be because of this. That might be the reason why. Mm, okay, everyone fall back. How much food do we have? A uh, thousand. Alright, yeah, we'll just pull back. Take what we got, we'll let them fight each other. And in fact, I think... I may want to challenge the counterpart now. Okay, we'll group up outside their nest. So that way we can do an initial assault. It is only... There's like four of them now, I think. Not sure how many, but... I think they added someone specifically for, like, advertising the game. Or something. Not entirely sure. Half this is hearsay. Oh, yep, they're challenging me. They've got all their creatures in there, except for the trap jaws, it looks like. Alright, go inside the nest. 
See if you can cut them in half. Or something, I don't know. Oh, no, we lost. Oh, yep, yeah, no, that's, that's definitely a loss. Okay, fall back. Like, right there, I guess. You know what? Go back to the fish. Since the leaf cutter's mostly fucked off. Nope. Everyone. Oh, there's a fish up here. Yes, perfect. Get that fish instead. And stop going down there. It's suicide. I, I'm not talking to you. Stop lighting up. I need more workers? No, I don't. It's fine. For now. Oh yeah, I, I forgot. I dug out the worker chamber and never filled it. Whoopsie. There you go. You happy now? Son of a bitch, I am being attacked. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, cancel like half of these. Hey, good thing I checked my chat because at least someone needs to be on top of this. It certainly isn't me. Yeah, I know I'm being attacked. Thank you for pointing that out. The rest of the colony will get there when they're good and ready. I can't believe they're both attacking me. Like, how rude. Whatever, we have a decent amount of food stored up. I'm not too, too worried. Yeah, fuck it. I'm going to have one group go out, and I'm going to have two group go stay here guarding the nest entrance. Should be fine, right? Should be fine. I think there'll be plenty of ants to guard our nest entrance, but also a lot to get food. Because, well, food's kind of important, don't you think? There we go. Extra fish. Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. How long have we been streaming? Only an hour and a half. Alright, good. See, this is what happens when you're not a complete dumbass. You can actually play the game. Amazing. Hmm. Thousand food. I'm going to upgrade these to level three. And you know what? I'm going to finish off the worker chamber. But I am a dumbass. Yeah, I know. There we go. Looking pretty. All sparkle up. There we go. Now we can just use the rest for uh, storing it for reinforcements. Dun, 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 dun. Almost harvested, and then... I don't know, do we attack the counterpart? Uh, nope, it looks like the leaf cutters are also challenging us, so there's that. So everyone just group up indoors. Hold the line, because I don't know how long this attack's going to last. Oh, it looks like the counterpart's given up. Maybe. Or maybe that was just like the units turning tail and running. Try putting all the food tiles at the entrance to the nest. Improve efficiency by the bit. I mean, it's at the front of the nest, just, you know, not the front. Like, I don't care about it. I want it concealed like that. Let me live my life, damn it. You spent half an hour trying to get out of your nest. I mean, you're not wrong. You're not wrong, but I was trying to rush. I was like, you know, let's just try and get to the good stuff, get outside and, you know, prove how easy it is. And then I died. <laughs> uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Good thing most of them are leveling level one. 
Oh yeah, the counterpart's only level one. Ugh, imagine if they were level three. Yikes. I'm feeling ballsy. Go, my minions, go! Flee into the world! Fly, my monkeys, fly! <laughs> think this swarm will be able to take him? I think we can. If we get a big enough swarm, I think we got this. Because remember, they need to keep attacking us in order to get strong. Whereas, because we we're, we're I'd say we're about roughly equal in terms of killing efficiency, but the major issue is and that's a small problem, but we'll deal with it later. Um, you know they can't group up, which means they don't have the numbers advantage, which means they can't stay alive long enough to get their buff rolling. Why his channel names is food? Because that is my last name. Yes, my last name is, in fact, Shepard. So, you know, it's just what I've used as like a joke. Like, when I first set my Snapchat account in my sophomore year of high school, I named it Shepard's Pie. And it's just always kind of been my thing that I just did. Just because I thought it was creative. I thought it was fun and clever and creative. My nest is fine. Don't you worry. The dead ants will provide. The dead ants protecteth. See? It's fine. You overreact. You worry too much. How's our offensive going? Oh! Oh, it's going great. <laughs> Looks to be going very well. Although, it looks like they did get a free hatch or something. Yeah, it looks like they're getting another free hatch. Kill the workers! This ain't no communist nest. We don't like workers here. This is a capitalist nest. <laughs> I am running low on food, though. That is slightly scary. Uh, but we're so close. I can taste it. I can taste the victory. Just need to keep up the offensive and we'll be there. Ugh. Bruh. Why is there no food on the way? Where's the nearest McDonald's? <laughs> they have some jelly upgrades. Normal fire ants don't, yeah. Yeah, Gene Thieves are so much stronger just because they get the jelly upgrades and also they get access to the strongest thing in the game. Royal Guard and Royal Decree. Like, literally those can save your butt so many times. Like, it's not even funny. Uh, I don't know if we're going to break through. We're, we're definitely running low on food. What's going on in my nest? How bad? Uh, decently bad, but... Nothing we can't handle. We are so close. We are tantalizingly close. I am keeping up the offensive. If we die today, we die as heroes. Oh, they're starting to get their damage buff. Oh, mm, mm, okay. I'm not dying as a hero. We're going to get some food. We're going to Kmart. That's so close. That's so close. Oh. Well, no. Shepherd's Pie is named after the food Shepherd's Pie. That's why I kind of like it being clever. And also, I am a fair bit Irish, so there is that. Although, granted, the Irish call it Cottage Pie, not Shepherd's Pie, so there is that. Facts with Pond. Mmm, I don't like those leaf cutters heading towards my nest. Just do not. But we'll take them out. I have full confidence in my army. Actually, I think the leaf cutters might be not as big of a threat as I initially thought. 
Because we are bowling through them pretty good. The only issues we had with the counterpart colony was literally just their damage was starting to stack. It's fine. We're golden. We got this in the bag. I don't even know why you're worried. See, we're expanding, if anything. Oh, there's a fish up there. Okay, well, um, here, I'm going to send two groups up there just to make sure we get that. Because that's a little safer than down here. That's one fish collected. Woo! Focus on the other fish, please. I'm going to try the same challenge as you, but with little black ants. Oh, this is going to be... That's going to be even easier than little black ants. I didn't want to do little black ants. I wanted to play as them. But I was like, you know what? I play a fair bit of them, so, like, you know, I'm going to do something else for a change. They're jumping you. I mean, not really. If anything, we're pushing them back. We got a fair bit of food now stored up. Yeah, I know. These colonies be whack, bro. And remember, the leaf cutters do cost a lot of food to hatch one ant. Like, I think the cheapest ones, aside from the workers, is eight food or something like that. It's either six or eight. And then the majors, you know, cost 15, which is absolutely insane. Wait, what enemies do you use? I just use all of them. I personally do, just because I like to see what happens. 250 food? Okay. Looking actually in a really good spot. I may want to push some... Uh, maybe I don't want to push the leaf cutters. Maybe I'll try again with the uh, counterpart colony. Because they do be looking submissive. Alright, everyone, group up outside the counterpart colony. Let's go. We can take them with our powers united. Oh, yeah, we're actually shredding through a few of their units. We'll just camp outside their nest for a little bit until I feel our groups are large enough. The swarm approaches. A new challenger approaches. Oh, we're taking on the praying mantises. Oh. Fine. That'll give us food while we keep our offensive going. So I am perfectly fine with it. Alright, everyone in the nest, let's go. Let's do this. End this threat once and for all. And that way we'll have every fish on the map to ourselves. You know, assuming the leaf cutters don't get in the way, but they won't be interested in them. Let's see what the inside of the nest looks like. Man, are they just ignoring my ants? How rude. Like, honestly, show some respect. Although, I think, well, I don't know. We may or may not be able to push through. Now, they can't hatch any units, like, normally. They have to rely completely on their cheating, so that is an advantage in our books. But they do get it fairly often. And once that damage starts stacking, yikes. Uh, I've corrupt alley, do absolutely nothing, just watch in progress. I mean, yeah, pretty much. It's a but. Big-headed ants, it's by M fire ants, and they are all corrupted. Oh, jeez. What's the difficulty of all the ants? Uh, shit, I don't remember. I think it's it's one level above above underhanded. Mm, I do not remember what it's called though. Oh, yep, there's a free hatch. Let's. Fine, I think. Probably. I mean, we got the, enough food to keep going, so... 
Oh, I sent them to Cheater. Okay, good. At least somebody's paying attention. Jeez, what do I pay you for? What do you mean I don't pay you? That's what interns do, right? They get paid to do something? Ah, well, you're lucky you have a job. Okay, we broke through that line of majors. Good. I don't know. There's another free hatch. Fantastic. Love it. Love to see it. When I'm almost broken through, it's like, JK, here's a bunch more of them. Oh yeah, those are slave makers, but they don't seem to be doing too well against us. Oh, tantalizingly close. I can taste the queen. Oh, so sweet. I don't know why I'm tasting ants, but you know, just let me do me. All right, I'll do me, you do you, and we won't do each other. Probably. Free ants, the one, <laughs> one of the worst things in the game, I know. It's absolutely annoying. That's why I'm so looking forward to the update where they won't cheat. At least I hope they don't. If they do, I'm going to cry myself to sleep. We've broken through the nest chambers. Oh, it's the moment we've all been waiting for. Fuck, I forgot about that. <laughs> but we're actually shredding through their royal guard even. I forgot completely about the royal guard, to be real. What? Oh, no, it's starting to become an issue. Shit. I don't know if it's a smart idea to keep going with the assault. No, nope, everyone back. Gather that fish, we need more food. All right, do I just need more soldiers? Yeah. They're, they're forces. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I don't know what I should do, to be honest. I'm kind of tempted to attack the leaf cutters after this. Let's gather this fish, and then we'll test the leaf cutters, all right? Maybe it'll be a good idea. Maybe it'll be a horrible idea. What even is this tip? Oh. Tell me about the difficulty. You only have around 300 or less seconds to kill it before they they get their ability back. Yeah, I know, but... And that is why I think Eruptors are OP in this, in this game mode. Like, the fact that you can spawn ants out of thin air is ridiculous. Yeah, you might be right. I mean... We were doing pretty good against them when we were above ground, so maybe below ground it'll be harder, but you never know. Because we we do rely on doing an absolute ton of damage, and they don't... I mean, they do a bit of damage, but... Again, when fire ants are so frail as is, it doesn't really matter how much damage you do. Just, you know, can you survive? About 500 foods left. All right. I'm going to gather everyone up outside the nest. I know we haven't completely gathered all the fish, but it's fine. It'd be fine. Free spawns and ability to, that makes more free spawns is pretty broken. Yeah. Not going to lie. Disagree with you with uh, on that one. Oh, you can see we're eggshells and green health bars, I know. Alright, what I want to do is group up outside their nest, so that way, hopefully, when we go in, it should be more successful. Alright, they're a little bit scared, but I kind of want more. What's going on? Okay. I'm just going to hold here, kind of trap them in. Oh, are you trying to sneak past? <laughs> Good luck with that. You're going to die. You're going to learn today. You do not mess with us. 
You fuck with me, I fuck with you. By the way, which has much higher DPS, the wood ants or the fire ants with buff? That's a good question. Um, I don't know. I would ask, I'd go over to the Discord and ask uh, Soul. He would probably know more than I would which ant has the highest DPS. Because, like, he's all into the numbers and stuff. Me, I don't care about the numbers. I just care about the actuality. And sometimes numbers and what happens in real life conflict. You know, it's like, on paper, this should work. But guess what? It doesn't. Man, there's a lot of them. And, yeah, I'm having a little bit of trouble breaking through, as I kind of expected. Where's the rest of my ants? Are you getting distracted by some food? Ugh. Listen, I know that praying mantis is sexy and all, but, you know, you gotta stay focused. Stay committed to the task. I swear. They just, they just want a booty call. The problem with leaf cutters, they don't have the damage. No, they do have damage. It's just, you know. They, they don't have a lot of DPS. They have good damage, but they just don't have the DPS of, say, elite, of fire ants. Everyone group up outside. Need to group up again if I'm to challenge that. Yeah, they don't have nearly as many numbers, which I'm liking. Alright. Here, I got a terrible pickup line for you to use. Tell me how it goes for you. Damn, baby, are you moss? Because I liken you. I know, I, I slap me too. <laughs> you can create two attack fronts. I mean, if I can break through. I'm going to get rid of this marker because I don't like seeing it. Oh. Just ants. That's why it was attacking me. All right. Grouped up enough. Let's go. Dive on in. All right. That should be enough to maybe break through. I don't know, actually, anymore. Because that is a lot of them grouped up there. Oh, well, actually, we seem to be making some progress. I think we can actually at least establish a foothold. Where we go from there? Who knows? Ah, I heard a free hatch. Damn. Can we get reinforcements, please, before we lose all of our progress? I would greatly appreciate that. No? Okay, then. Uber creatures spawn. Oh. Alrighty, then. Did that... Beetle just randomly jump in and just die. Alright then. Good for that beetle, I guess. Actually, I think these fire ants are going to break through eventually. I just don't think that they'll be able to hold off long enough for our spawns to happen. Because there's not too many of them. And we are doing a fair amount of damage. Yeah, they got everything back. I know. It's a problem with cheaters. You know, I like how people are like, oh, cheaters never win. Obviously, you've never played this game then. Because then you know that cheaters 100% do win. All the time. Every single time. <sighs> and even then, we... Uh, actually, it, the queen isn't that well guarded. We can get there before another hatch. I think we might be able to... Oh, no. Can we get there in time? Yes, we can. Go, 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 go. Swarm. That is what we do best. Swarm. Mm, I don't know. I do not know. Turn off food gathering so you don't get distracted. Please. We have a chance to end it. Can we end it, though? I don't know, looking real iffy. Looking very iffy. God damn it. No, no, no. Alright, everyone. Take this fish. 
take fish. And honestly, I'm tempted to take out the spider. <laughs> Do I create... You know what? I'm doing it. I'm creating another ant chamber. Because I need more ants, I think. So I'm going to do it. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I need more ants. Remember, I'm not even at 50% of my population. Which is incredible. You're right. I keep on forgetting that, like, I can't, you know, the, the, the enemy colonies have food even when I don't kill them. Like, I keep on forgetting about that. I keep on forgetting that the AI just doesn't raid them for food, whatever reason. Well, I mean, the leaf cutters can't. But everything else can. Or, the counterpart can. Oh, yeah, and that's a big point. We can't raid the leaf cutters, which does make me mix sad. Right, let's start getting some more ants out in the field. Uh, do, do, do. Once we raid the fish, then we'll go. Actually, what we do is we just split them up in a half and go. And then we'll just send them down <clears throat> once they're ready. It's not big headed colony, it's definitely a little black ant colony, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. These heads don't seem that big at all. They don't, they don't look like my head, you know, after I finally do something intelligent. Oh, <laughs> poor beetle. It did. Ooh, that, I, <laughs> oh, here, let's just all group up in one group. I don't care. You need two fronts, one to keep the food in, and one to attack, so, eh. Do I, though? Do I? Probably, but I don't care. I'm going to do my own thing, anyway. I think with with enough food and enough units, we can take out the uh, leaf cutters, no problem. Because we were pretty close. And even the counterpart, too. It's just like, if we have enough food to keep the assault going, and enough ants there to not make it matter too much. Mm. Ugh. Harvest my children. Feed! Go there. I swear to God. I was going to say, I don't know why sometimes the ants are just like get super derpy and just don't know how to pick up food, but it's kind of infuriating when they do. It's like, please, there's one food there. Grab it while you're there. No, I leave now. It's like, but why do? I'm just going to pick this place, 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 clean, jeez. Everyone head over here. Come along, children. Oh my god, yeah, look at all that food. In fact, I think I got enough food, I can get enough food from this, uh, you know, from all the chambers that I may be able to actually get another going yeah and then that one I could use for food gathering I guess because like I would I'm fine with using workers for gathering it's just like they just don't have the strength to fight anything that may contest them for that food that's the big issue I have with them oh yeah wow they haven't even really touched that bit well, meat is definitely back on the menu. Cool. Um. Oh. Wolf spider. I was like, wait a minute. It's fine. Probably. I'm going to ignore it and hope it's fine. 
I'm gonna build a bunch of work or soldiers. Oh, yeah, it went into the soldier's nest. Mm, I don't think it's so fine anymore for that uh, wolf spider. Just saying. I think it's going to go horribly for them. Yeah. And that's what we'll do. We'll just do this, and this should be enough. It's fine. See, it's dead. And it's right there on the queen, which means... Listen, the queen just ordered some deliveries all, all right? And Domino's was a little late, so they had to hand deliver it to her highness. All right, that's all collected over there. Over there, please, if you will. Now, bro, the queen killed the spider. Oh yeah, definitely, 100%. We all know how badass the queen is. Over there. And yeah, look at the food. Look at the food. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Who doesn't love a Patrick Stark quote, eh? The battle, the battle has begun. I'm going to have this group over here gathering the fish because, well, I think it's probably a good idea to do that. Do I need any more workers is the question. I think I'll be fine, but you never know. All right, go up there then, I guess. Yeah, that should be good. Do I need to go over here? No, but I will, just because I feel like it. Because I want all the bits of food in this nest. I don't want to come back here ever again. Although I might have to, because, well, my food stores are running full. Okay, that was a good expanse. That was, that was a good expansion. Although my computer is starting to lag a little. Probably fine. She's just standing there. Menacing Lane! Alright. Good, are you? Okay, good. Gathered all the food. I think I want to... Yeah, let's take out... Another chamber. That's what I'm doing. Jeez. Why do you think I have them in a separate group? All right, chill. Chill your beans, man. No one wants hot beans. What do you mean people only like hot beans? No, what do you mean nobody likes cold beans? Well, I just don't like beans in general, so... Uh, upgrade you. Sure, why not? Put you in the main army group. And let's see how well this goes. Oh, yeah, we're still collecting food from there. Jeez. <laughs> I know it's not a lot, but I want it. And that's what matters, right? 700-ish food... Yeah, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Oh, look at that. There's a fish the counterpart's trying to steal. But there's a fish over here. Oh, and a frog. Frog. Froggy. Alright, you know the drill. Let's go. So, I mean, you should be done by now, right? Yeah, you are. It's his first time. Congratulations. It was the delay of the net. Yeah, uh-huh, sure. Sure it was, just like I'm the Queen of England. If I was, I'd be a little surprised. But at the same time, it would explain so much. 
So, listen, leaf cutters, I think you're a little out of your league at this point. You barely survived last time, and now we're even stronger. Oh, but it seems like you got even stronger. Holy shit. That's a lot of you. That is a whole lot of you. It's fine. Everything is fine, right? My game can stop lagging and my troops can get to the front. Then it'll be fine. Yeah, I think it actually will be fine. Yeah, wow, they are determined to break us. But I say nay. Nay! Okay, yeah, it's taken forever for them to group up, so... Although, um, maybe. Maybe we just need to keep going. Or maybe we're just losing too much food. Nope, now I feel a lot more confident in us. Did you say nay or nay? Uh, uh no. Which one's the horse? Cause that that's the one for me, because you know, I I am a horse. Obviously. I don't know. I do not know. It was looking pretty good there for a bit, but now they're I don't know. Oh, and we are running very low on food. Ho, 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 ho. Wait. Oh! They're attacking us! When did this happen? I didn't even know this was happening. Please gather the food. That's better. All right, uh, we're just going to hold out in our nest for a while and pray we don't die. Yeah, they're jump. They're trying to jump us. Yep. Yeah. And I've only got two food, so I can't hatch any more ants. I just have to hope that well, they can't kill me. They aren't the most effective units attacking me because they're not grouped up, but been wrong before, very wrong before. And is it just me or is there less food spawning now? It's not just my imagination. It actually is, there's less food. Because there's the one fish here, there's the one fish here, there's a fish there. That's it. Wait a minute. Or is it because the leaf cutters are taking this, the, uh, the uh, landmarks? Interesting. I thought so, you cowards. Time is it? Uh, Eric, it's nine fifty-eight. Well, listen. If I hadn't failed so much at the beginning, I would I would be a lot further on. But I'm not. I don't think I'm going to break the counterpart just because of their ability. I really don't. The the royal guard is going to end my day no matter what I do. I think, and with less fruit spawning. Big ol' yikes. Listen, I'm gonna leave this stream here. I'm sorry. I'm today was a today at work kicked my butt. My boss had me doing two jobs by myself, so that's fun. I was running both the bar and the kitchen. Um so I'm sorry, I will be going. I I I know you just got here and now you're leaving. Look up rule 34, Queen Ant. Mm, I'll do that after the stream. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know, consider liking and subscribing. Um, 
I'll see you sometime. I don't know. Later.